back here on Jiggy Jag TV. JiggyJagTV.com, also RossVideos.info. I'm Jigman Freud, your favorite community producer. And uh, I'll tell you what, we got a returning, but the returning champion is with us. Cliff, jump in there, brother. What's going on? What's your big Chris <laughs> GLV? I'm here with the best, the best of the rest. You know? Now, uh, are you really a, a Reds fan or you just wearing red because it works? No, nah, I'm actually wearing reds because, <laughs> you know, everybody call me, you know, Big Cliff, you know, so I had a C in the front, you know. I'm always the man with I the hat. I thought you were a big young. Barry Larkin fan. Ah, no, nah, man. You know, I don't even get a chance to watch too much baseball, but, you know, shout out to LeBron, Miami, all that, you know, perfect weather. I'm going to be that. asking you about that in a minute. <laughs> now, uh... Introduce the man you got next to you. Man, this man right here sitting next to me. He's the man behind the business. Yeah, this is my man right here. This is my, you know what I'm saying? Actually, my big brother, this Kyle. You know what I'm saying? As far as all my stuff from when we back was S Corp was on the first on the radio. This is the man that was behind everything, the calls, scheduling the show, stuff like that. This is the man that actually first turned me on to get my ass cap and all that stuff. And, He's and the J.J. Dillon to your full yeah. horseman. He's the man in my ear telling me to elevate my game, so. You know what I'm saying? So, He's your Bobby the Brain Heenan, the Andre the Giant. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> now, uh, you, you got, what do you think of the Blue Goat, brother? You just got uh, The Blue Goat, I, I, I can't lie to you. It's a, it's a beautiful place in there. Um, I'm just so hyped that, you know what I'm saying, Salina's embracing hip-hop music like this and, and the things that Cash Allister and also Jiggy Jaguar are doing for this for this hip-hop in and, 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 and Kansas. is it's excellent, man. A+. Plus. Now, uh... What, what do you got coming up, brother? You got anything coming out soon? <clears throat> actually, I got the Fast Lane Music uh, mixtape I'm going to be dropping, hosted by. Um, we haven't actually uh, selected the, the DJ yet, but the features are going to be nuts. We're going to have Fat Pimp. We're going to have Huey on this one. We're going to have Big Hud on there. It, Giovanni. This is about to be some crazy stuff, which is actually going to set some standards as far as mixtapes and albums in Wichita. So be ready for it. Now, uh... Compare the Blue Goat to some of the venues in Wichita. I've become Blue Goat spoiled because of the lights. Man, them lights are <laughs> blinking, and you know what I'm saying? I was going through some things, some dramatic <laughs> things, but actually, I loved it, man. The sound system was good, staging was good, security was excellent. And I mean, it was, you know, it kind of scared me at first when I walked through the door and nobody was patting everybody down. I said, this ain't going to go down in Wichita. Not no pat down. You better, you better have a vest or a gun, one of the two. But, you know, I think it's a beautiful thing that, you know what I'm saying, hip-hop is, is elevating it and there's no problems at hip-hop shows. I think this is excellent for Kansas. And I think this is where we're going to see the Midwest get back Cash to. Cash always takes the performers backstage and says, if you have any problem with anybody, there's a big-ass field next to the bar. Now, uh, you got you got all sorts of things coming out. Tours? Are you doing anything? What, what performances? What, what are we talking? About? Um, actually, uh, I'm gonna be doing some shows with ESG. I actually was just out in Colleen with him. I did a show with him out there in Colleen, Texas. I'm gonna be doing a lot of moving around Oklahoma City, uh, to Texas. I'm working with Kyle Lee. We got a video we're gonna be doing for About No Bread. That song right there. Uh, we got the first half of the uh, Kill Dr. Hate Go Ahead video up. We're going to be having that second half coming up here in a few weeks. So just be looking out for it. We're doing videos. We're doing shows. Everything is we're, we're trying to take it to that next level for you guys, for the fans. So uh, you're, you're just doing big things, brother. Are, are you planning on stopping anytime soon? <laughs> uh, no, I'm, I'm going to tell you what, man. Last night I was asleep, and I had a vision that I seen a red octagon. And you know, red octagons mean stop, but you know what? I woke up in the middle of the night, so they told me, ain't going to be no stopping. I'm facing full tunnel vision. I'm getting to it, man. Now, uh, is, 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 is your partner over here just silent, or is he silent but deadly? Ah, like, oh, man, my brother, man, this is the business man right here. This is, the, this is the man right here. I'm going to tell you like this, though, man. This is the man right here that might not say nothing. But when it, it comes to them ass cap checks not coming through, he gonna call you. He gonna call you. You can call him silent but deadly. Yeah, they gonna, he gonna call you. He gonna make sure the business is right, you know. So, and he handles all my stuff, stuff like that. And he's always in my ear. You need to do this. You need to do that. So I'm, you know, I'm always grateful to have a brother like him and, and have a staff that I got. Him, Nick G. Uh, my assistant Sakura, so I'm always good to have people like that in my corner. Tell me about the other guy you had on stage the other night. Who, who was this cat? Uh, that was, cat? He just kind of blew out of here like a blowfish in a twine factory. Uh, right? that, honestly, that's one of the <laughs> legends. That's one of the legends in the game in hip hop in Wichita. You could do your research on him. That's Big Sight Zilla, Big Sight. He had the Mospreneurs album. Um, Gourmet Game, one of the biggest CDs to ever come out of Wichita that's been looked at. I, actually, when I was in Houston, the guy from Rap a Lot was talking about that CD. 
I mean, these guys, that, that that was a legend right there. And I was happy to actually come to the Blue Goat in Solana to do my first show with Sight. So, you know what I'm saying? I was happy to uh, be able to share that with you guys. Now, uh, t tell me about LeBron, your, your LeBron take. I've been trying to get all the rappers to give me their view on LeBron. Are you happy? Are you burning the Cleveland jersey? Well, what are you doing? I'm actually happy he went to Miami because I'm going to tell you like this, for the weather, I, I'd be in Miami myself. The only thing bad you got to look at from a Kansas perspective yeah. is he took Mario Chalmers' number. So, you know what I'm saying? He's going to be. <laughs> That's right. Shout out to Mario Chalmers, man. KU, you did your thing, man. But in the league, it's He does a basketball it's tough. every year in Salida. It's tough, man. Shout out to Mario <laughs> Chalmers. Do your thing, man. But LeBron and them, they they on it, man. I think the heat gonna be tough, but ain't nothing stopping my LA boys. I'm rolling with Kobe all the way to the finish, to retirement, to the jerseys and the Raptors. Oh, come on, they're building the dynasty, don't you? You know what they say? Don't work harder, <laughs> work smarter, and that's what Kobe's doing. Man. Don't you know they're building a dynasty yeah. down there? Nah, that's that's the triple threat in Miami. They got the big banners that said we finally did it or whatever the hell. <laughs> they having all these celebrations. Well, well, you know what they say. <laughs> Don't count the chickens before they hatch. That's what they doing. They count the chickens before they hatch. So, so uh, who's, who's, the, who's the greatest rapper of all time you want to play with? Play a show with? I mean, the greatest rapper of all time. Man, my one of my favorite rappers of all time. I can't even lie. I'm I'm cool G rap. I like 50 Cent. You know, I, I, Jay Z, them is my favorites, man. The new school cats are all good, Wayne and Kanye, and all them. But them are like my three favorites right there. Big Daddy Kane, I love them dudes. Them, when you watch them, they dance and everything. I'm trying to do that, so. dancing. <laughs> you see me? I almost tripped and fell. There you know? <laughs> were no video cameras. I know my guy. Well, thanks for catching I up. Appreciate with it, man. Good stuff. Are we going to see you on the radio show tomorrow, or are you heading back to Wichita tonight? Um, <laughs> to be continued. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> Let's go watch more here on Cheeky Jake TV.